Hello there. So, yeah, I'm just there to show off this new mothership I made. It's kind of buggy when it comes to the rotor blades from mills and double mills. But other than that, it kind of works perfectly. We can go to, well, let's see. So one of these is desert. I think it's this one. And um, it's a nice ship, just like normal. You have the statues holding it up and everything. But it can teleport. So here's desert. Um, as I mentioned though, middle blades are buggy. They go flying around like this, causing the whole ship to spaz out. Um, I'm still not sure how it's supposed to fix that. I mean, we could just not use the links to have mills, but mill blades. But that can be kind of sucky. It would it would be bad. So yeah, we just had to show it off. Um, so far, the, um, we only have four teleporters. It is increasingly hard to make each teleport, so we I never managed to make more than four. Well, this is this is the first time I ever really made a ship. But yeah, it can teleport to as I said four different locations. We have mainland, bento, desert, and plateau. And then we have buildings here. Uh, everything is fireproofed. We put quite a lot of work in this. About four or five hours now. Uh, over there is the mainland station, so to say. And everyone that sits on a seat on the ship will get teleported with it. So it's really useful. I mean, if you had one of these ships, you could make a teleport over each island. And then you could raid each island, like, really easily. Just teleport them to them and go above them. Like, no walls can stop you from that. And yeah, I own other buildings on this, because we had to teleport to evade some people who tried to destroy it uh, when we were building. I, it's kind of hard to lock it in place in the air again. Uh, I managed to do it four times, once for each teleport. But I'm not sure I can do it again. Especially not now that we have the buildings. It's even heavier. Yeah, that's kind of it. So I'm just going to show the, the plateau teleport. Oh yeah, and the thing is, everyone that uh, touches a gate can teleport to the ship. Or can teleport the ship. Um, kind of meaning that... Oh yeah, it's really spacing out. But that means that uh, other people can teleport the ship even though we don't own it. Like, I was on main level before and a guy, uh, I'm not sure where he was, but he teleported the ship when no one was on it. Yeah, we should be fireproof them. That's a problem. That's actually the solution though, just burn the middle blades off. Yeah, you can see the mill blades spinning around here, and uh, you can see that this is where we built the bakery the first time. Also, when these mill blades spin around, they push the ship down, because we wouldn't be this low if we went for them. The bottom would be about up here. But yeah, we can fly, and teleport. I'm not sure who, who that was.
But yeah, that's what we built today. Kinda. I mean, it took... Oh yeah, it's still today. It's really nothing that special. It's just an ice ship with the teleports. But you could live up here. You could get some farms. Catch some fish. And uh, each time you teleport, it's uh, it resets the height to what it was when we set the teleport. So in theory, we will never touch the ground. I mean, we can fly forever. And last time, which was yesterday, we made an ice ship. Well, I made a teleport way out here. Uh, it was the first time I ever made a one of these last time. So this is the second time I ever made a, a teleporting airship. And it's still really hard. Going to do the mainland teleport. Wait, that's Bento? Huh. Probably, yeah, you probably shouldn't jump off. Uh, holy shit. Ah. Uh, Okay, go and hide inside here. Yeah, it's fun, although dangerous. Look kind of far. <laughs> it's spinning like crazy. Yeah. I mean, like this is less useful than teleport hub. I mean, for everyone, but the person who owns the ship is kind of immortal. I mean, if someone comes here, you can just teleport away. Oh. Um. And you can live up there, and you will never fall, you don't have to ever touch the ground again. But yeah, it's kind of it. Don't have much more to say or show. So see you, I guess. Yeah, bye.